the demand for high-performance GPUs is at an all-time high. By 2025, advancements in AI, gaming, and content creation will push graphics card manufacturers to innovate at an unprecedented pace. This rapid evolution has led to the arrival of two highly anticipated GPUs, AMD's RX 9070 XT and NVIDIA's RTX 5070. These GPUs promise next-level performance, improved power efficiency, and cutting-edge technology. But which one comes out on top? Does AMD finally have a competitor that can dethrone NVIDIA's long-standing dominance? This comparison breaks down everything, from specifications to real-world gaming benchmarks, to help you decide which GPU is the better choice. Let's get started. AMD RX 9070 XT vs NVIDIA RTX 5070 What's new? Both GPUs are more than just minor upgrades. They represent major leaps in design, efficiency, and processing power. With new architectures and enhanced cooling systems, these GPUs can handle demanding 4K gaming, high refresh rate esports, and next-gen AI applications. AMD RX 9070 XT Built on AMD's RDNA 3 architecture, it focuses on raw power and efficiency, aiming to provide excellent performance at a competitive price. NVIDIA RTX 5070 Powered by NVIDIA's Ada Lovelace architecture, it prioritizes ray tracing, AI-driven upscaling, DLSS, and advanced graphical fidelity. With such impressive advancements, it's clear that competition is heating up. But which GPU offers the best value? Specifications Breakdown AMD RX 9070 XT Architecture RDNA 3 Stream Processors 3840 Base Clock Speed 1.5 GHz Boost Clock Speed 2.5 GHz Memory 12 GB GDDR6 Memory Bandwidth 384 GB per second Power Consumption 250W. NVIDIA RTX 5070. Architecture. Ada Lovelace. CUDA cores. 5888. Base clock speed. 1.3 GHz. Boost clock speed. 2.3 GHz. Memory. 16 GB GDDR6X. Memory bandwidth. 512 GB per second. Power consumption. 300W. Performance Comparison. Gaming Performance. When comparing performance, two things matter most. Raw power and efficiency. Both GPUs offer impressive improvements over their predecessors, but they shine in different areas. 1. 4K Gaming. The RX 9070 XT delivers a 20% boost over the RX 8700 XT, making it a powerhouse for AAA games at ultra settings. The RTX 5070 offers a more modest 10% improvement over the RTX 4070, but its ray tracing and AI-driven enhancements make certain games look significantly better. In titles like Assassin's Creed Odyssey and The Witcher 3, the RX 9070 XT outperforms its NVIDIA counterpart, delivering higher frame rates at max settings in 4K. However, in games like Cyberpunk 2077 and Call of Duty, Modern Warfare, the RTX 5070 pulls ahead, thanks to NVIDIA's superior ray tracing and DLSS capabilities. 2. Ray Tracing and AI Features The RTX 5070 excels in games that utilize ray tracing, such as Cyberpunk 2077 and Control. NVIDIA's DLSS technology allows for smoother gameplay even at higher resolutions. The RX 9070 XT, while powerful, does not match NVIDIA's ray tracing performance. However, AMD's Fidelity FX Super Resolution, FSR, provides a solid alternative to DLSS, offering decent upscaling without sacrificing too much quality. 3. Esports and Competitive Gaming For competitive gamers, high refresh rates and low latency are essential. The RX 9070 XT performs exceptionally well in esports titles like Valorant, CS2, and Overwatch, reaching well over 300 FPS at 1440p. The RTX 5070 is slightly behind in raw frame rates, but NVIDIA's reflex technology helps reduce input lag, making it a solid choice for esports. Power consumption and efficiency. Efficiency is a crucial factor, 
especially with rising electricity costs. The RX 9070 XT consumes 250W, making it more power efficient than the RTX 5070. The RTX 5070 has a 300W TDP, meaning it requires better cooling solutions and power management. If power efficiency and lower temperatures are your priority, AMD's GPU has the clear advantage. Memory and bandwidth. When it comes to memory performance, NVIDIA takes the lead. The RTX 5070 features 16GB of GDDR6X memory, offering higher bandwidth, 512GB per second, for better texture handling in high-resolution gaming. The RX 9070 XT includes 12GB of GDDR6 memory, with a slightly lower bandwidth, 384GB per second. This means NVIDIA's GPU is better suited for demanding 4K gaming and AI workloads. Cooling and thermals. A good cooling system extends the lifespan of a GPU and ensures stable performance. The RX 9070 XT has a dual fan cooling system, making it quieter and more efficient than its predecessors. The RTX 5070 features a triple fan cooling system, offering better heat dissipation but slightly louder operation. For those building smaller PCs, AMD's lower power consumption and cooling requirements make it easier to manage. Pricing and value. Price is one of the biggest deciding factors for most buyers. RX 9070 XT, expected to launch at $599, making it a strong value for money option. RTX 5070, estimated price of $899, making it considerably more expensive. While NVIDIA's extra features, DLSS, ray tracing, justify the cost, AMD offers better raw performance per dollar. Which one should you buy? Choosing between these GPUs depends on your priorities. Buy the RX 9070 XT if Heavy checkmark you want high performance at a lower price. Heavy checkmark you prioritize raw frame rates in traditional games. Heavy checkmark you prefer a more power-efficient GPU. Heavy checkmark you don't need ray tracing as a priority. Buy the RTX 5070 if Heavy checkmark you want cutting-edge ray tracing and AI features. Heavy checkmark you play games optimized for NVIDIA hardware. Heavy checkmark you need more memory and bandwidth for 4K gaming. Heavy checkmark you don't mind spending extra for premium features. Final thoughts. The AMD RX 9070 XT and NVIDIA RTX 5070 push GPU performance to new heights. AMD delivers excellent value and raw power while NVIDIA dominates in ray tracing and AI acceleration. For budget-conscious gamers, the RX 9070 XT is the clear winner. But if you want the best features and don't mind the higher price, the RTX 5070 is a strong choice. As the GPU market evolves, competition between AMD and NVIDIA will only get more intense. Which GPU are you choosing? Let us know in the comments.